Hello everybody, welcome to uh, Let Us Cook a Vegetarian Meal for You. Get it? Let Us? Let Us? <laughs> ha 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 ha. And this is my wife Deb Gray. She is a vegetarian. Yes. But, and I've had this meal before without meat in it, but this time she's adding chicken to my meal because you don't mind cooking with no. meat. It's just that you don't eat it yourself. Being a vegetarian is my choice. I don't force it upon other people. That wouldn't be right. And so can you explain to everybody what the hell you're doing? <laughs> what the hell I'm doing? Okay, I'm making pasta dish with rice fettuccine. And this rice fettuccine because I don't eat wheat. Um, I find that wheat upsets my stomach. So I've gone to the, the wheat pasta, you know, rice pasta. I put in two portions of rice pasta, which is the fettuccine, and little thicker noodles. I'm going to let that cook. My other ingredients have been getting ready. There is chicken, which is seasoned with salt and pepper, and a little bit of thyme. How much thyme? Oh, oh, that kind tick, of thyme. Tick, tick, yeah. Uh, I've got some goat's milk feta cheese, which is here. Uh, seriously, goat's milk feta cheese? That's what I had before. That's what you had before. Oh my god. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, see, you oh. didn't even know, did you? Can I change my mind? No. It's just, uh, never mind, I'm not going to talk. <laughs> we have artichoke hearts, Calamata olives. This is sliced sun-dried tomatoes, extra virgin olive oil, balsamic vinegar. And then I've got the olives, which I've cut up into small pieces. Here, fresh tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, and green onions. That's all the ingredients that I put into this dish. Now, while the pasta is cooking away here, I put Larry's chicken on to cook. Turn that on. I can always set up through this. And I'm going to prepare the rest of the, the vegetables. Somebody sort of went, oh, at this. Maybe I won't put quite as much in because we'll probably pick it all out. I hate wasting it. I do eat cheese, so I guess you'd classify me as a, a lacto-vegetarian. I went a whole year without eating cheese and dairy, and my body was craving cheese. So I listen to what my body tells me. And okay, we want cheese. I will eat cheese. And, and there are some like uh, vegetarians that you know they'll argue with other people about vegans. Vegans, okay. They they are very very strict. They won't eat any meat. They won't use leather. They won't eat honey because it, the bees have been mm -hmm. utilizing. You know, utilize the bees and their that. I mean, it, it, it takes things to no, a that, different No, that's, that's fine for them, right? But, but then they attack other people because, well, you're not a... Exactly. Yeah. If somebody says they're vegetarian, uh, oh, well, you eat cheese. Well, you're not a vegetarian. Well, no, yes, I am. I'm a lacto-vegetarian, which is, I eat cheese. There's lacto-ovo-vegetarians, which means you eat cheese and eggs. Now, the cheese... They all say that the, the calves are uh, taken away from their mothers so that the, the, mil <laughs> the milk should be for the baby, baby cows, not for people, or baby goats as this case may be. Um, cheese, they say, is made from, uh, with rennet, which is from, uh, well, animal stomach, which they'll say, again, that you know, you're not vegetarian if you eat this. Now, I'm sorry, but there, there are extremes. I just eat this way because my body You're just responds. eating healthy food or trying to. Yeah. Uh, raw vegetables, 
lots of raw vegetables. Most of the time I really eat salads um, with different, different mixed vegetables in them. And uh, for I, instead of ice cream, you have rice dream. Rice dream. It's a it's it's a, a mix made with rice actually, rice milk uh, made into a frozen state. It looks the same as ice cream, has a slightly different flavor, but I enjoy it. I don't, uh, I don't eat much in the way of milk, and that's why I, when I eat milk or eat dairy products, it's usually goat cheese. It doesn't affect it doesn't affect my system as much. The chicken's done. No, the chicken's not done. Oh. The chicken has to be well cooked. <laughs> So how long would a meal like this take to cook? Uh, about as long as it takes for the pasta to cook, which is about 15 minutes. Everything else is basically here. I'm just going to add it to the pasta uh, after I drain it. So while it's still hot, everything here gets tossed in, mixed around. You're hot too. <laughs> well, thank you. Now what did you buy today? What did I buy today? Oh, uh, let's see. Mm, new bikini? A new bikini. <laughs> you know your uh, white cotton bikini video has almost 500,000 views? Oh, you're kidding me. Yeah. Okay. That's almost half a million people that see me in a bikini. Uh, that's scary. <laughs> Just wait until they see me in a bikini. That's really scary. Hey! <laughs> okay. Don't need too much of that. Now I worked out while I was getting this ready with all the ingredients that my portion, the way I have it set up, will end up with about uh, 450 calories. Yours will have a couple of hundred more, mainly because of the chicken. But there's only a single portion of chicken here. When I buy chicken from the store or beef or anything else, I put it all into individual portions because Larry's the only one eats it, and this way nothing gets wasted. And, and I'm not a big meat eater anyway. No. So. And I find that this meal here is almost as delicious as a Big Mac and fries. Blech. <laughs> See some of those commercials on TV, and it's just like, oh, no, thank you. So that's basically the amounts that I put in right there to add the flavor to my meal. So Spe speaking of way. extra virgin, I, I knew an extra virgin girl once. Oh, did you? Yeah. Is she still up to your left? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, that's, that's shooting below the waist. <laughs> really? <laughs> or whatever. Really? Okay. Well, that's just extra virgin olive oil and the balsamic vinegar, which is going to make my sauce, which I'm going to pour on my pasta. And these are the marinated artichoke hearts. Probably be enough because that leaves enough for another meal. <laughs> Drain the pasta. My camera keeps slipping down. Uh -huh. Also 
add red pepper to this, but I don't find it necessary. And let that just sit on the heat. And then through. And I help with the meals too because I get the plate them. I got the meal already. Oh, forget it. <laughs> <laughs> I get the forks. It's great. It's so tasty. It's fit for a king or a stud. <laughs> Thank you, honey. You're very welcome. <laughs> 